hello everybody my name is Munirat and welcome to my channel I'm a makeup artist and content creator please subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscription button below I really love it and join the fam turn on your post notifications as well um starting off with a random Korean mask I picked up from Miniso store at Palms Mall this is an hydrating one and I use this on her face to provide hydration and moisture because it looked a little patched so that's what I'm doing. I'm just making sure I'm arranging it well on her face and then I'm taking it off and you can immediately see how hydrated it looks. Next, I'm filling in her brows with the Binwa Beauty Luxe Brow Pencil in True Brown when it focuses. I really love this pencil because it's very soft and helps me with precision and the package is turning. The only con is the pencil breaks a lot and so it does not last. Next, I'm going in with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Fawn and Medium Beige to outline her brows. And then I use whatever is left on the concealer brush to prime my eyelids. Starting off the eyes, I'm using these two shades in the Morphe 35OM palette in our crease and making sure I blend it enough to blow out the edges. Next, I'm using LA Girl Concealer in Fawn for her lids and placing that a little bit higher than where her lids naturally stops, just so I have a little more space there. And then I'm just doing like a messy cut crease, it's not much of a cut crease. Taking a dark brown shade from the same palette using a BH Cosmetics blending brush. I'm tapping inwards into where the concealer stops to have sort of a soft smoky look and I'm just doing that on both eyes. Then I'm just setting the concealer on a lid with a nude color from the palette using a dense eyeshadow brush from BH Cosmetics and this is what it looks like for now. Next, I'm using the Omari Code Moisturizer to prep her skin and you can immediately see the plumpness in her skin. All products will be in the description box below, so check that out. Moving on to skin, I'm using Huda Beauty Nymph in Aurora for highlights. <coughs> I couldn't find my small blending brush, so I decided to use the no one, and that's when I knew I no Look at her face. No man. She's looking like a trophy. No man. My sister was shook. Okay. So quickly going back to the eyes, I decided to put a little shimmer on it, and I'm using Saint Monique pigments in Angel for this. See how intense she is. Love it. This is another Nigerian brand I absolutely love. I use it on the skin as well. Pop on some lashes and mascara and put more down with the eyes. Next, I'm using the MAC Correcting Conceal Palette to blow out a little discoloration around her lips before going in with the Huda Beauty Full F Filter Foundation. For highlights and concealer, I'm using the Black Opal Stick Foundation in Truly Topaz and Suede Mocha and blend, blend, blend. I have noticed I tend to use the same brush for a lot of things. 
so that's what I'm doing now so now I'm just putting the dark shade on the corners of her of her nose around her jawline around her hairline as well and I'm blending 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 she never stop blending blend till your arm are tired and then blend again so now we are going to set the highlight using the chanel translucent setting powder in 03 and you can use any setting powder you prefer i don't usually bake for a long time so after applying a highlighter and mascara i'm blending out the powder blend 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 next i'm using mac mineralized powder in dark deepest to blend out and set the contour making sure to tap in and not swipe and i'm just doing that around the contours of her face her forehead her cheekbones her jawline as well just setting and tapping everything in moving on to blush i love a good peach blush and i'm using this ones from mac cosmetics in peach twist and ambient rose the blushes look good on everybody love it smile for me sis i like to swipe a little across her nose and forehead for added warmth my favorite part will always be lips i'm using my favorite mac lip pencil in chestnut Colourpop and Makeup Sheila Cream Lux Lipstick in Quickie and Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm in Diamond Milk for her lips. I like the contrast the liner gives this shade of peach lipstick too. So I'm just outlining her lips right now. See how gorgeous that peach lipstick is. So it's not too bold everything is just subtle and peachy and girly very nice next i'm going in with mac gold deposits highlighter because why not go big or go home right And I can't believe I'm using another highlighter. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills and Amrezi highlighter. And I'm just putting on a little bit using my MAC 226 tapered blending brush for this. To set the look, I'm using the MAC Fix Plus. And I'm spraying that all over her face. And this is the final look guys I really hope you guys like this tutorial please give this a thumbs up if you did and don't forget to subscribe see you guys in my next video bye Mwah.